Are you interested to know how to be good at MC? MC as in Master of Ceremony, not Minecraft. I'm Nirmala Trisna from Bali, Indonesia, and you are watching MC Bali channel. I would like to share simple, essential tips if you are assigned to be an MC. First and foremost, be confident. Sometimes the next question comes, how if I don't feel confident? I'm scared. It is understood that not everyone have the same level of confidence. But of course, we have to build our confidence. But how? First things first, we have to love ourselves. We have to understand who we are and appreciate everything that we have. We have to know our strength. We also need to know our weakness. Analyze them and then embrace our strength and then try to brush up our weakness. How we can diminish our weakness or maybe we can camouflage them. Be honest to ourselves and then bit by bit, we can build our confidence. It is very human to make mistakes. We are all human. Sometimes we do make mistakes. But of course, we aim for perfection and we have to know how we can reach to that point. If we are worried that we might make mistakes on stage, of course, the point is or how to avoid making mistakes is by preparation and doing rehearsal. So talking about preparation, I usually contact the person in charge or the person who contacted me, who assigned me to be an MC, and then come up with questions. Dig a lot of information from that person. What is the event? What is the purpose of that event? Who is the event owner? Who is the audience? Who is the speakers? Or maybe who are the performers? Who are the entertainers? When is the event? Where is it? How the event is managed? So try to get as many information as possible. It's just like getting to know someone. The more we know that person or that thing, the more confident we are to approach that person. The more familiar we are, the more open we are to show our true selves and be confident when we are delivering the event or delivering as an MC for that event. So once we gather all the information, then we have to sit down, prepare the script, and then do the rehearsal. If you are still confused on how to make a script, don't forget to watch my other videos on my YouTube channel. I have prepared or I have published several videos on script making. The next thing is about wardrobe. Wardrobe is an element that we must prepare, including hair and makeup. Whatever the dress code is, make sure that we look sharp and also up to date. Well, I don't mean to be shallow, but to be honest, we all do make judgment on how people look. And then this is an event. There is a certain message that is communicated by the event to the audience. So we have to make sure that how we look does present that same message that the event wants to portray or to communicate to the audience. So put extra attention on wardrobe hair and makeup. And then comes to the D-Day. What should we do? Come early for rehearsal. Come early to get to know the environment and everyone that is involved in the event. Come early so we can know who the event manager, who the stage manager is, who the sound man is, the lighting man, the videographer, where the backstage, whether we need certain seats, table on the backstage, how we approach the backstage to the stage, and then if we need to go to the restroom, we need to find out where 
that restroom is. So try to find out and be familiar with everything or all aspects of like behind the scene, like how the event is prepared. Don't forget to ask the microphone, do a sound check, and if it involves lighting, try to ask the, the event team to check on the lighting on you when you stand on stage, because how we look, how the lighting uh, will affect our look on the video or uh, from, the, uh, from the audience view, we need to make sure all look well. And then we can rehearse on stage, try to walk from backstage to the center of the stage, how we want to uh, move around the stage, how we hold the script and the microphone, do test check, microphone check, and just be familiar with the overall flow. And then wait behind the stage when the countdown comes, three, Two, one, take a deep breath, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, smile, walk to the center of the stage, it's showtime. So that's all from me, simple tips on being good at MC if this is your very first time being assigned as MC. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like this video if you do like it and share it to your friends, your colleagues who might feel this information is useful. Once again, thank you very much. Don't forget to subscribe. I am Nirmala Trisna. See you in the next video.